Lights out. Time to run what you brung. They're away in a puff of smoke, and it looks like it's a good start for Falzarezzi and Max Mulder as Mulder jumps. Aleski and gets into the third position. Logan gets away clean, and now it's side-by-side. -side. Falzarezzi along with Max Mulder as they head through the S's here, and Mulder's going to take the second position away from Falzarezzi. And the race is on down the straightaway, but Falzarezzi trying to come back. It looks like he's got Aleski behind him, and Juan Vasquez is losing a couple positions as they're all spread out. Three wide coming out of that corner. Looks like Nick Van Gelder all over the back of Garcia. And look at this. Is, am I seeing things, or is that Gabriel all the way up to the 12th position from 19th already? And we've got a gaggle of cars back here. Contact between a couple of them. Dion Stahl becoming a sandwich. Cameron Weston Edwards rubbing wheels with Gabriel. And Aleski, they're side by side. Down to the inside, Guillermo's going to make that pass. And Brian Power has retired from the session. So it looks like Brian's day went from bad to worse. He is done here on lap two. Eric Holm dived into the pits after contact early in lap one. Okay. I'm take a look. Oh, look at this. This is Gabriel on board trying to get by Aleski. Ooh, and that is some tight racing right there. Up oh, yellow flag sector three. That's Dion Stahl. He was running in the 14th position. And it looks like Dion is done for the day. Not sure what happened there, but he looks like he has crashed out. We've got ourselves a, look at, I can only assume right this second is a virtual safety car. Got yellow flags in all three sectors. We get back to go green flag racing. Logan Aron, the control car, takes off, pulls a half second gap over Max Mulder. Falzarezzi down into turn one. Sandro Julius looks like he's losing a position out to newcomer Gabriel. Eric Holm has had a crash in sector one. And is that going to be another full course safety car? You said safety guy indeed. Yeah. Trying to jump that start. And there he goes. And immediately pulls a gap on Falzarezzi. Good restart by Logan Aron. Look at the gap he's pulled out already. Because, oh, it looks like one of the Alpines ran wide coming out of that corner. Oh, and there's contact between, looks like that might have been, that's Juan Vasquez and Max Mulder. There's contact. Oh, and there's more contact. Looks like Max uh, might have been cutting him off there a little bit. In the meantime, Alexia Hill taking Nicola for P2. Twice back onto the straightaway. Looks like Max Mulder's gone around. Got spun coming out of that corner as we ride along with Nick Van Gelder trying to get by Cameron Wesson Edwards. He's got the DRS open. He's going to beat Cameron to the braking zone. Runs a little wide. Here comes Cameron back at him again. Nick able to pull away. And side by side back there. It looks like that's Vincenzo and Gabriel. Three-car battle, though. Cameron Wesson Edwards trying to hang on. Gabriel's going to go all the way down off the track. They're three wide coming down the straightaway. Gabriel touches oh, Cameron. Oh, oh, and there's a big wreck. They're all Didn't three cars are involved. Nick was close there to be collected as well in P7 as an innocent bystander, but luckily he could avoid it. But, man, that was an unfortunate spin by the three cars. Oh, and no. That... Alexia spun in the round. And... Oh, and, and I think uh, um, Lucas crashed into him as well and got front wing damage. Whoa! And I think Manuelito as well. Here comes Van Gelder. And 
Valzarezzi dives into the pits. Safety car. Along with Luke Smith. And we have a safety car. Safety car being deployed. There he goes. Oh, somebody lost from wing. And he stacks up the rear field. Another great getaway by Logan Aron. <coughs> Ooh, Vincenzo with a bad restart. He already lost four position going into turn two. And Caution flag flies sector two. Yeah, yes, we'll go to that. That was a uh, McLaren of Robin Herdestagen as we ride on board with Nick Van Gelder. I'm sorry, Luke Smith. Get my Red Bulls mixed up side by side with Juan Vasquez trying to hang tough. Luke oh, yeah, slides the back end, almost lost the back end of that Red Bull coming out of that corner. Trying to stick with Juan Vasquez, and Vasquez able to hold off Luke Smith. And I'm not going to lie, there's not a lot of drivers that can say they held off Luke Smith like that. Meanwhile, Tim Fox is going to Oh, and look at this. They're side by side to make contact again. Guillermo's going to try and get down to the inside. Mulder able to hold him off, but they both run a little wide. And Guillermo's all over the gearbox of Max Mulder as Max tries to hang tough and hold him off. Dives to the inside. He's going to make contact with Mulder again. Pushes him wide. Mulder cuts back across the nose of Guillermo. This is unbelievable. Guillermo's going to cut the corner again, and he he goes. And Mulder goes with him. It goes through... Niccolo. No, that was Ficenzo. Ficenzo makes it through up into the seventh position. Running in third, and he's got fourth, fifth, and sixth stacking up oh, behind him and around this Valzarezzi. That moves Luke into the third position, and he's bringing Aleski with him. And Sandra's best opportunity is this is the final lap of this race. He gets a good run coming out of this corner. Logan Aron crosses the finish line to pick up another win and extend his championship points lead. Cameron Wesson Everett just picked up a three-second time penalty.